I'm ready to start. I'll call when it's done. Who are you? I've got three main questions for you. Why are you doing this? Oh, come on, Mick. There's been one guy my whole career who didn't know full well how he's found his way into this room. How you got here was every night you said you were working late at the office. Every flirtatious smile at the waitress. Every hidden bank statement. Every compromise, every lie, every decision you ever made. Look, I haven't got the money, I swear. Question number one. What's your biggest regret? What do you mean? Exactly what I said. Oh, I don't... I'm not paying the boss back the money I owe him. That, that's right, isn't it? You know what my dad taught me growing up? He'd say, son, the whole world runs on fear. Every person out there, all of them are afraid of the dark. Afraid of the unseen. Afraid of the bumps and the whispers in the night. They don't understand the criminal world. They don't understand that we have, we have rules and we have codes. They don't understand that there's something out there that is far more terrifying than us. A man with no morals. A man who'll do absolutely anything to save himself. That's the kind of guy who will destroy your life in the blink of an eye and not think twice about it afterwards. That's the real danger. And there are far more of them than there are of us. He'd lean in close so I could smell the whiskey on his breath. And he'd say, I'd rather tangle with a wolf than with a snake. You're not a snake, are you, Mick? No, no. Then answer the damn question and answer it like a wolf. My daughter. What about your daughter? Hannah, she's 15. I, I feel like I've missed most of her life so far. I work a lot. And I, I do things on the weekends. I'm at the clubhouse, betting. I'm at the clubhouse all day Saturday through the night and into Sunday morning. I've missed every one of her softball games this year. Do you think you're a bad father? I don't mean to be. I mean, my old man was an arsehole. I always thought I'd be better than him. I, I love my girl. My dad did nothing for me. There's, there's nothing I wouldn't do for Hannah. Yeah, I've messed up, sure. And I've got issues. But there's nothing I wouldn't do for my little girl. Question number two. What's the best decision you've ever made? Look, I've done a lot of stupid things in my life, but the best decision I ever made was, was marrying my wife, Hannah's mum. She's had to put up with so much from me. Does she know that you've redrawn your mortgage to pay the clubhouse? No, but I'll, I'll tell her. And, um, how many times have you cheated on him? Just the once. 
all right, twice. But, but they didn't mean anything. Mick, 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 the sins of the flesh, mate. It's better to live alone in this world, to be a solitary man. Men are made to be solitary. All right, Mick, we've made it to the top of the mountain. The boss wants his money. Fair enough, wouldn't you say? But he also knows that you can't pay him like he just said. But he can't just let you go, you know why? Because that sets a precedent. We can't have that, can we? You are going to pay one way or another. No, oh, you don't have to do anything. But I'm going to give you a choice. The boss wants me to slice open your Achilles tendons. Do you know what they are? What? They're the snappy little tendons right here. Oh, it's like a motherfucker. And you're probably not going to be able to walk ever again. No, ever again. You can't do that. Yeah. Option number two. I go around to your house and I pick up Hannah and I take her around to the boss to do with her whatever he likes. It'll be a little bit less bloody for you, but probably not for her. How does that one sound? No? Oh, okay, I won't touch your daughter, but I'll get you another little option here. How about this? I jam this knife right between your Oh, no! You can't do that. No. Oh. No, just let me go. I'll I go back to the boss and I say, oops. Don't do that. You tried to escape. No, but please, don't Could do that. Not. It'll be quick no. and quick. That's the one thing I can guarantee is that your whole family no, 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 will no, 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 be no, 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 safe. Don't push it. Please. Now the two options I can make no such guarantee. No, you can't just let me go. That oh, question? I'll try to make you can't do that. What do you choose? Oh, I can't. I don't want you to let me go. <laughs> I know which one I'm picking, but I'd be fucked if I'm going to crawl around on my hands and knees the rest of my life. No, I don't want to crawl. This is your big oh, moment. This is time for you to take control choose. of your life. What do you choose? I can't choose. Do you want me to go get your daughter? No, no, not my daughter. No, I right, then choose. No, I can't. Choose. No. Choose. She ain't girls. <laughs> all right, buddy. This is gonna hurt like all levels of hell. <laughs> Hey, how you doing there, big fella? You alright, huh? Huh? I wish I could tell you this is as bad as it's gonna get. But it's not. Hannah finishes softball practice at 4.30. She then walks along Parsons Road for 15 minutes, arriving home at 4.45. Yeah. She's home alone right up until your yeah. wife gets home from yeah. work. Every time, every single time they say their family is the most important thing, but every time it is nothing but a masquerade. I can't tell you how many guys I've had in this room say the exact same thing. I'd do anything for them. I'd die for them. But when it comes down to the not even once. No. No, I'm coming back for you in a couple of days. No, 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 come on. It's done. I'm on my way to get the girl now. <laughs>